Hi guys, welcome to Coternix Corner. So in this video, we're gonna finally get around to building the scale cage. Uh, I've had a lot of people request that I do a video on this. It's a very simple project, but it is probably gonna be one of the uh, most used pieces of equipment uh, in your quail operation if you weigh a lot of birds. Um, basically all it is is a simple wire cage uh, that sits on top of your scale uh, for you to place your birds in. And all you need to do is place the cage on the scale, zero out your scale, and then you're ready to start weighing birds. The nice thing about it is it's going to keep your birds on the scale. They're not going to, you know, want to jump off and uh, fly away. Or you got to chase them around your, your quail room. Um, and it also it keeps them calmer so you can get, you know, more of an accurate weight. So let me go ahead and set this aside and I'll briefly go over what you're gonna to need to build it. Uh, first off, we use uh, J-clips. So you'll need a bag of J-clips and some J-clip pliers. Um, a, a rubber mallet is handy for bending the wire. You could actually do it by hand, but a rubber mallet will make it a little bit easier. Uh, and as far as the wire goes, um, I used uh, leftover wire that I had from cage building projects. Uh, the bottom and the side pieces, I kind of bent like up in this little U fashion here. And uh, it's made out of half inch by one inch uh, welded wire or hardware cloth, uh, which is coated. Now you don't have to have coated wire because um, they're not you know, in the cage long enough to really you know, bother their foot or their feet. Um, so uh, the other wire that I use for the sides and the top are the uh, one by two inch uh, welded wire. And there's the top piece. And you can see on the top, I kind of bent that one edge over a little bit. And I'll show you why I did that in a minute. Um, so basically, uh, starting out with your, your bottom and your sides piece, uh, the overall length of that wire is going to be 6 and 6 is 12 and 7 is 19. Um, you're going to make a bend at 6 inches on both sides. And basically shape it in a fashion like this. And what I did was I took... Uh, this piece of wire and laid it on a board where I wanted my bend to be and using a rubber mallet I just uh, kind of used it and, and bent the uh, the wire over the edge of the board now you can do it without uh, using a hammer um, you could probably just you know bend it in shape by hand but I just did that to get a little bit cleaner bend um, the next pieces you'll need will be your two side pieces and they're made out of one inch by two inch welded wire and the measurements on those are seven by six you'll need two of those and then also for the door you'll need a piece that measures seven inches by um, I believe it's eight uh, seven yeah I believe it's seven okay uh, but anyhow what you're gonna do let me get this out of the way some of our J clips out and ready. Basically what you're gonna do is take and stand one of your walls up. Let me get my pliers ready. And then just J clip that wall in place. Now you don't have to follow um, the sizes that I made uh, my cage. You can pretty much do whatever size cage you want. Um, the reason I make it uh, this size is I don't want the birds to be able to move around while they're in the cage. I want them to you know, sit still so I get an accurate reading on my scale. Okay, so once you've got the, uh, the sides clamped on to your bottom and two sides piece, uh, you're gonna take the, uh, the top piece and you can see where I did that little bend over the end. And the reason, the reason I did that bend is to get it to close and kind of close up over the other end. Let me uh, straighten that out a little bit. And 
and then basically all you need to do is uh, J clip that down. And then uh, you can go around and just kind of, you know, bend things to where they'll, uh, you know, sit cut square. But basically, that's it. That, that's your cage. It's, it's a very simple project. I see I've got to make a few bends on this to get everything closed. But uh, that's it. Very simple project. And uh, then, uh, like I say, to use the cage, uh, you'll just set it on your scale and zero out your scale and then uh, you can place your birds inside okay so that's pretty much it for this project guys i know it was simple i know it was easy uh, and you can pretty much design your own style of cage but i just wanted to show you how i build mine um, it is probably uh, one of the most valued pieces of gear that i have here in my shop uh, it's easily built you can build it out of leftover wire um, but it's, it's really going to save you uh, when you go to start weighing your birds, then you're going to be able to keep them on the scale, get an accurate weight, and they're not going to get hurt, you know, should they jump off your cage, fly around or whatever. So guys, uh, thank you for joining me today. If you're not already subscribed to the channel, please do so. Helps me out. You can get notified of any new and upcoming videos if you hit that notification bell. So thanks again, and we'll see you on the next one.